Hello everyone! I'm going to read a story today by a man called Dick King Smith. He's written lots of animal stories. One of the best known ones is probably Babe. Have you seen the film? The one that we're going to read today is called The Spelling Bee. For weeks Noah's Ark had been sailing about on the great waters of the flood and the animals were getting very bored. Noah noticed this. They haven't got enough to do, he said to Mrs Noah. They need to use their brains. We'll have a competition. What sort of competition, said Mrs Noah. Noah thought for a bit. Then he said, I know, a spelling competition. We're going to have a spelling competition, he told all the animals. To see who is the cleverest among you. Who would like to take part? One of the two elephants pushed forward. I am the biggest animal in the ark, it said, so it stands to reason that I must be the cleverest. What do you want me to spell? Your name, said Noah. Oh, that's easy, said the elephant. F, all, all. Stop, said Noah. I'm afraid you're spelling that wrong. Next, please. I am the tallest animal in the ark, said one of the two giraffes. So it stands to reason that I must be the cleverest. What do you want me to spell? Your name, said Noah. <laughs> well, that's easy, said the giraffe. J, E, R, hold it, said Noah. I'm afraid you're spelling that wrong. Next, please. I have the thickest skin of any of the animals in the ark, said one of the two rhinoceroses. I must be the cleverest. What do you want me to spell? Your name, said Noah again. Well, that's easy, said the rhinoceros. Er, I, n hang on, said Noah. I'm afraid you're spelling that wrong. Next, please. Then one of the two monkeys scampered up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I must be the cleverest, it said. The others don't know what you want them to spell, but I do. You want me to spell my name? Go on then, said Noah. Well, it couldn't be simpler. Mm, uh, mm, stop, said Noah. You're wrong too, I'm afraid. In fact, it's beginning to look as though there isn't one animal that can spell its name correctly. Would anyone else like to have a go? At that moment, one of the two bees on the board the ark came flying bzzz, and chanced to land on Noah's hand. Aha, uh -huh, said Noah, here's somebody else wanting to take part in our competition. Who me? said the bee. Yes, you, said Noah. Oh, but I'm no good at spelling, said the bee. Well, go on, said Noah, have a try. Tell us how to spell your name. My name, said the bee. Yes, bee, said bee. Yes, cried Noah, that's right. B, go on. The bee sat silent, so Noah gave it a little pinch to encourage it. E, cried the bee. Yes, said Noah. E, keep going. And he gave it another little pinch. E, cried the bee again. That's it, cried Noah, you've done it. B, E, E. You and you alone have spelled your name correctly, so you must be the cleverest creature on the ark. Who me? said the bee. Yes, you, said Noah. Now buzz off. And then everybody, except the elephant and the giraffe and the rhinoceros and the monkey, gave three hearty cheers for the clever little bee. Do you think he really knew, or do you think Noah might have helped him just a little? Hmm. I hope you enjoyed that. Take care, everybody. See you soon, hopefully. Bye.